What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing aviators and a Superman hat and today I am wearing a lot of Superman right now. I got the, the fly Superman shirt on, the new, or not, I guess not new, the old Superman hat that I haven't brought out in quite a while. It's been a little bit, but today we are bringing you another episode of Combat for Dummies where I teach you a martial arts technique or combination that you can practice there at home. And today we're going to be using my trusty bow staff, my second favorite weapon for those of you that don't know, and we're going to be going over the hand roll. Alright, so, whoa, I am, this is not the way the light is working, hang on. All right, guys, hopefully you can see me a little bit better. I know the lighting's kind of weird, but that's what happens when it's too hot to film at noon in Texas. So uh, we're gonna be going over the hand roll. Now this hand roll, you guys have seen me do quite a lot and I add it with a lot of different tricks. And so this is the basis to build up on other things and other more advanced combinations. That's my dog, if you see her uh, walking around here. Jess, come here. It's my dog right here. Her name's Jess. All right, look out. Thank you. So, what we're gonna be doing is taking it step by step, going over with your bow staff. So, you can do this in both hands, and in fact, I suggest practicing with both hands, uh, but we're gonna practice with our right hand right now. I'm gonna show you with my right hand, and then you're gonna transfer it to your left. To your left. So you're gonna take it, and I want you to hold it just underneath the center, just underneath the center. Uh, and you're gonna take it and I want you to give me a thumbs up just like this bang You're just gonna give me thumbs up just like that now You're going to take that thumbs up. You're gonna point it to your left and then you're gonna rotate it until it's pointing To your right you're gonna rotate it up and over until it's pointed to your right now Just past that 180 degree turn just past that 180 degree You're gonna let go just like that and it's going to roll across the back of your hand and back into your hand just like this so letting letting go and back into your hand now one thing you don't want to do is chase it don't try to catch it don't try to like jump it real quick because you will end up dropping it and it won't work out try to be as smooth as possible going from one hand to the other don't freak out and jerk around just stay nice and smooth and once you go in one direction go in the other direction so instead of doing a thumbs up going this going to your right you're going to do your thumbs up going to the left and it's going to go over where your pinky is across the back of your hand so you're going forwards and backwards just like that forwards and backwards then you're going to switch sides and on the left hand forwards and backwards nice and smooth forwards and backwards and then when you get comfortable with it you can do a combination uh that makes it look really cool to do. It looks like a, uh, a figure eight almost. You're gonna go forward roll, then you're gonna go behind you, backwards roll. In front of you, forwards roll, and backwards roll. And that, that will look like this. That's how you get this trick that I do. Ah, almost messed up there. That's how you get this trick that I do all the time in my combinations. And you can do like combinations with it where you turn, where you spin, do all that stuff, toss it in the air. That's where all of that comes from. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this combination today. I know the lighting kind of weird because, well, it's really hot in Texas and it was like 98 today uh, during the, the middle of the day. So I had to wait till the sun went down a little bit. So hopefully you can see it all right. If you can't, let me know down in the comments and I'll figure out how to fix that in the future. But hope you guys liked this video. If you want to see more of these videos, let me know down in the comments of what techniques you want to see. If you've seen me do a technique, then point it out let me know on my Instagram if you guys follow that where, where you'll see all of my different combinations that I do uh, just randomly throughout the, the weeks um, if you want to see me if you want to see me teach you how to do it let me know down in the comments of those videos or just let me know in the comment of this video now if you like this video I'd really appreciate it if you hit that like button and shared it around to your friends uh, share it on Instagram, on Twitter, and wherever. Let let your friends know so they can check out the channel too. Cause I uh, would really, I really want to get this channel bigger uh, because of some things with the Rebellion channel that's gonna be changing. 
Um, and I'll go into that actually in a later video, so stay tuned if you're interested in that. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore, this is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out.